I'm telling you now, this town is accursed. You know, it started 20 years ago. It was the night of the Valentine's Day dance at the Union Hall. The biggest event of the year. It had been a tradition for over a hundred years. Everybody was there except for seven miners who were out at the Hanager mine. Five of them still down below. Two supervisors were waiting for the men to come up. <laughs> Anxious to get to the party, they left before the men were safely out, <laughs> failing to check the methane gas levels in the tunnels down below. The five men were buried alive as the town continued its party. <laughs> For six weeks, we dug around the clock to try to save them. After we broke through, one man was found alive. I was the one who found. <coughs> Harry Warden spent the next year in the state mental hospital. Exactly one year later, on Valentine's Day, he came back to town. He killed the two supervisors who had left the post the year before. Then he cut out their hearts and stuffed them into heart-shaped candy boxes. That night at the dance, he found the boxes, blood dripping out the sides. Inside was a note, a warning from Harry, never to hold a Valentine's dance ever again. Every February 14th, Harry comes back to town. His pickaxe stained with blood, waiting in the shadows of the Henniger mine, just for someone to kill, should they not heed his warning.